Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Stick on Tech. In this interesting DIY session, we will show you how to make a portable FM radio. Everyone like to listen FM radios. Almost a century after radio broadcast first began, we still tune into our favorite shows every day, whether it's in the car, at home, or on the way to work. In FM broadcasting, the frequency of the carrier wave is modulated to encode the sound. A radio receiver extracts the original program sound from the modulated radio signal and reproduces the sound in a loudspeaker. In this video, we are going to make a portable FM radio with low cost modules with a battery backup of 4000 mAh. If you are a tech lover, you can simply build this radio at your home. For more details, visit stickontech.com or check out the link in the description. So hastily, let's get started. Okay, let's talk about the components required to build this radio. We are using one pair of 18650 lithium ion cells. Each lithium ion cell has a capacity of 2000 mAh. The cells are connected in parallel to get 4000 mAh. The 3.7 volt battery charging module is used to charge the batteries. This module is providing battery charge and discharge protection. The terminals on this module are 3.7 volt output, battery terminals, and the terminals for connecting 5 volt external charger, a 5 watt speaker, FM radio module. This is a PLL based digital FM radio module with an inbuilt audio amplifier. On the front panel, a LCD display is provided and controllers for changing the volume and frequency. On the back side, we can see a 3.5 mm headphone jack, terminals for connecting 3 to 5 volt DC, antenna terminal, the pre amplified stereo and mono outputs, and 5 watt speaker outputs. This micro USB socket can be used for external USB audio and the URT pins to control the module through serial port. And last, a 25 cm antenna. To make the enclosure, we choose 4mm PVC sheet. For placing the speakers and controllers, we made holes on the facing sheet. Then the cut pieces are joined together according to the designs. Now let's come to the wrapping. After vinyl wrapping, the enclosure became stunning and attractive. You can use different wrapping colors to get the mold more stunning and attractive. The installation was very simple. The speaker is covered with a mesh closure to avoid physical damages. On the back side, we have provided an on-off switch and the antenna is mounted near to the switch. The speaker is connected to the left speaker terminal on the module. A 5V DC socket is provided on the right side to charge the batteries. After connecting the DC line and antenna cable, the FM module mounted on the facing sheet with proper fittings. The DC socket is connected to the charging terminal of the module. The power for the FM module is directly driven from the output pin. Finally, we connected the battery pack to the module. 
Now arrange the modules and cables neatly. Since this is a portable unit, we have to care about the components inside the enclosure. The cover of the backside is fixed properly with screws. To get a pro look, we provided a transparent sheet on the facing side. If you pay my mind, call me on now. Wow, the FM reception is pretty good. And awesome sound quality. If you like this project, the modules and components we used are listed in the video description. For more tech updates, please visit stickcontact.com. Thank you for watching. We'll see you on the next video.